Is it possible to be extravagant in 2021 with a starting budget of nothing? Let's find out. Reading is a beautiful community. It has been my home for nearly four years and I really can't thank it enough. Sure, it holds a majestic river for everyone to enjoy and there are epic sceneries painted from the sketchbooks of heaven. But more than anything, there are some mind-blowing people, amazing people. Through them and the love that they carry, I have been given a life worth giving as well as the tenacity to believe that the impossible is made possible. That's why I'm honored that my journey starts here. Hi, my name is Phil, and for the next month or two, I want to show you that even with nothing, you can do a whole lot. That with just a little sheer will and faith, you can do amazing things. That being said, allow me to show you my budget. <laughs> That's right, it's a new month, March 1st, 2021, and I have zero dollars in my account. So let's make some money so that I can cover the essentials for a cross-country trip. Gas, food, water, shelter, as well as some money to give away. That kind of is the purpose, right? Because I'm building my capital today and I don't quite have my bank card, I think it's coming in today, my goal is to give away 20% of my earnings by the end of this evening. On that note, I should probably make a post on Facebook to see if there's anyone in need. But first things first, I gotta do something about this here. Zay. Okay, it's 11.08 a.m. Let's see how much we can make in a few hours. We will set our time to 3.30, then we'll take a break and get going again. Boom. All right, first order, Einstein's Bagels, 4.3 miles at $8.50. That fits the bill, let's go. in the last hour or so. The 20% is gonna look good. The orders are just rolling in today. It's kind of strange for a Monday. But then again, I think people really want their orders delivered to them at work. Next order is Fresh Fire Grill. We got two orders. 2.5 miles all together for $13. Yes, sir. Wall green orders are pretty awesome. It's just chocolate bars and maybe a couple TV dinners. This one has a lot of medicine. Yeah, that's a thing that I don't really know much about in the store. But hey, I'm not alone because even the guy that helped me, he doesn't even know where this stuff is. that my pizzas are gonna be about 10 minutes, which is actually a good thing because now I could talk to you guys about something that's been popping up quite a bit lately, maybe three or four times. Every time I've mentioned this trip to someone close to me, they've told me, Phil, you should get a sponsor through DoorDash. And my response is, if they really wanna sponsor me, they could find me themselves because it defeats the whole purpose of giving money with a $0 budget. I really wanna encourage other people to do this too. So if they had to call DoorDash to get started on something like this, 
it just wouldn't happen. I mean, could you imagine millions of people knocking on DoorDash's door and saying, hey, can I have a sponsor? Nah. If you want to start giving, man, you can start right now. All you have to do is turn on the app, drive, and start delivering. It is kind of the beauty of this job. I'm a session update. Start of the day really strong. I think I had three back-to-back -back stacked orders, which always helps. And then it kind of tapered off there with the Little Caesars order and the Walgreens order. But all things considered, we're doing pretty good. We're knocking back about $28 an hour over the course of the last four hours. So we're off to a great start. Then of course we bumped into Trevor right outside the restaurant I was eating at. The guy was super dope and chill. Loved talking to him, hearing his story, and not to mention his music. It was pretty good. After he got done playing Hotel California, he actually asked me to pray for him, which is pretty cool. Most people don't ask for prayer. In fact, a lot of people push you away if you ask for prayer. So that was pretty cool. Anyhow, we're going to get started with our second dash of the day. Let's book some profits. And the one right before that was $126.12, which brings our total to $160.95. But that does not include the $15 that I got in cash tips today. So, all together on our very first day, we got $175.95. 20% of that is going to someone in need. A total of $35.19. I threw up a post earlier on Facebook to see who was in need, and I got quite a few responses, but one really stood out to me. Hi, David. Hey. What's going on, my good man? Yeah, I miss you. It's been a long time. I've missed your YouTube channel. You have two. You already have two. <laughs> <laughs> I have two. This is David, everybody. David is the one that reached out to me earlier. He's got a friend who who just uh, got COVID recently, uh, right? Is that Jason? Yeah. He's... Jason, God bless you, man. Sorry that you have to endure that. Your YouTube right now? I'm not live, but I'm going to post it. So, oh, okay. did you want to say something, Jason? Yeah. Yes. My uh, advice to all the people out there is to always wear your mask as 
much as possible wherever you go, always wear your mask. And, uh... I'm a Man of God. I'm a